it's never too late for a first. Stillwater Wrestling reached the final round for the first time in school history. Shakopee was their opponent, a school looking for their first state wrestling title in Class 3A. The lower weight classes were a sore spot for the ponies, particularly for Dylan Doffenbach. He'll have plenty of chances in the future, but he was pinned by Pearson Manville. Shakopee wins the first three matches to take a 13-0 lead, but Stillwater's sweet spot was the middleweights. And Reed Ballantyne was clutch throughout the tournament. He scores a fall against Tyler Jones in the 126-pound class, energizing the Ponies fan base. The rally continued with Keeler Carlson at 132 pounds. John Kroll of the Sabres tried his best but couldn't get the flip on Carlson. That would pave the way to a 14-4 victory. Here come the Ponies! Stillwater held a 16-13 lead at 152 pounds, and Will Harder would extend it. He gets a crucial takedown over DJ Smith, and his 4-3 victory gave the Ponies a 19-13 lead. But the Sabres were anything but long in the tooth. Trailing 19-16 at 170 pounds, Carson Manville turns things around with a pin on Hudson Day in 38 seconds. Shakopee retakes the lead. Stillwater needed a win at 220 pounds to stay in contention, but Shakopee's Joey Johnson holds off Will Gleason to clinch the title. 35-22 is the final after a fall in stat padding time, but you wouldn't find a hint of disappointment over Stillwater's silver medal. I've been on the team since seventh grade, and every, every year I was looking forward to coming here to the state tournament and place in some way, one way or the other, but second place to me, it's just like first place. It doesn't matter, you know? In the end, we might not have won the actual duel, but we won as a team because we're here together and we're having fun. That's all, that's all that matters in the end.